Good morning. All right, so today we're in the studio. We're getting ready for a permanent makeup um, procedure treatment. And so some of the stuff is covered up, but I will be doing a little small tour of our studio um, treatment area. Um, we have retail up front um, with waiting areas and, and waiting areas here on the side. And then also the treatment rooms in here in the back. Um, we have supplies, utility room, and that's right. So I'm gonna give a small tour of um, the treatment studio. But like I said, some stuff is wrapped up because we are getting ready to do the permanent makeup procedure today. Um, I like to get everything ready and out so there's no cross contamination. We are state regulated and licensed. So um, studio here in Tulsa, Alabama, downtown. Um, we do appointments only right now. Um, some days we do walk-ins and those days are you know usually the sign up front. But um, anyway, so we'll do a quick tour real quick. I just like to um, use all disposable needles. Um, we cut down the cross-contamination. Like I said, I don't like to go fumble around and look. I like for my stuff to be all set up. And I will walk you through, we'll do another video of how I'll walk you through our permanent makeup setup. But today, um, we're just gonna do a small tour of the studio. Okay, so I'm going to give you the quick tour of the studio. So this is one of the waiting areas. We have a waiting area out the front with the retail area as well. But this is one of the areas you sit in because you have to separate it when you have an aesthetic spa um, and you do aesthetic body art services. So um, separation. So then you come into the studio and we are have a very, very, very old building. So we had to be really unique in the way that we did this um, studio spa. And me and my husband did this together. But um, anyway, you know, I love antiques and I love thrifting and junking and yard selling. So a lot of that is incorporated in here um, to maximize the space that I have. Um, I love organization. So I got a lot of containers to hold stuff and I'm always getting those because you can never have enough. It seems like is you wanna um, make sure that things are organized and put away in their proper space. Um, you have to have your license and your degrees on the wall at your aesthetic spa um, if you're charging a fee. It's illegal to do facials, eyebrow waxing, waxing, um, body art, aesthetics, anything like that is, is illegal if you do not have a license. Um, is illegal if you're charging a fee for that in the state of Alabama. So you got to make sure you display your license because when they come in, they're going to want to see it. Um, the health department does come in and they do inspect. So you got to make sure that you have your infection control and your OSHA stuff up to date, your MSDS sheets on the products that you use because certain parts are not allowed to be used on clients due to safety reasons. So over here is our my like what I call my lash area. And um, we have our lash stuff here. And of course we have the um, drawers and stuff. We try to keep stuff put away um, so there's no cross contamination. Things are organized and put away so there's nothing, you know, it's gonna get on anything. Um, more drawers over here. You have to have your sink. Um, do you have to have your sink in there? And um, like I said, more stuff, more display. Over here we have our steamers, more lights. Um, spa equipment, our little refrigerators, um, you have no food in those. They are only for your um, glues and stuff like that that need to be refrigerated in cosmetics because you're not allowed to have food or drink in the treatment areas whatsoever. More spa equipment, tables, chairs, rollers, more drawers. I got this at Hobby Lobby. I absolutely adore this because it's tiny, tiny drawers that hold really cool stuff and I love that. Um, then you have I have my eyebrow sterilization thing. We you have to have a legal sterilization room in the back, and they do come in and inspect that. And I do have a sterilization room that they do inspect. Um, you have to have your biohazards plan in order and your containers, and they have to inspect that as well. Everything has to be done. Um, we use disposable needles, disposable every bibs, um, disposable wraps, disposable everything. Um, pretty much the only thing that's not disposable are our machines, which we have to properly wrap and do. Um, you have to have gone through your um um sterilization stuff with them as well they do come in and inspect so like i said that's that um our chair of course um now when we're doing aesthetics we take the pillows out but for lashing it's okay to have your lash pillows we do cover our lash pillows though as well with wrap um things like that anyway so this is our little spa i love what we've done with it it's not very much space but you don't have to have much space as long as you have it like legal and it's very safety for your clients as well as yourself keeping yourself safe and your clients safe is the most important part but it's really pretty i love the way what we did with it um you should see the before and after pictures is like totally different than it is in here you're not allowed to have carpet you got to have flooring as well and like i said you can't do facials and stuff at home there's no mobile facial bar um not in the state of Alabama because it is illegal if you're going to charge a fee to do that. Um, you've got to have a license to do those things 
in the state, um, body art license, um, if you're going to do fine line tattoos, cosmetics, stuff like that, you can, you know, you have to have that done and they do come in and inspect it. So anyway, this is our little spa, um, our little treatment area. Um, so yeah, I hope that helped a little bit, but, um, our waxing area, our hair bead extension area, stuff like that is in here. And that's it. I'm a CRMP as well. I do work um, full time, but in our spa, I do all the things that I'm legally allowed to in the state of Alabama in here. We do piercings, fine line tattoos, um, body art. We do waxing lashes, eyebrows, and we do facials. We do hair removal. Um, I'm laser certified. We do those things. And that's what we do here in our spa. So I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope you have a great day. 